joyful, engaging, collegial, lover of critters, um, loves Miami Country Day School. Spontaneous, quick-witted. In our show this year, he was Superman. I mean, this, this is a tireless and really funny teacher. The children adore him, and they should. I also think of you as being very versatile because I know you've taught many different grade levels and you've done a great job on all of them. I remember when you were a fourth grade teacher or maybe a fifth grade teacher, when you went to middle school, when you came back to lower school, and you just always seemed eager to do whatever you were asked to do. I've worked with him closely. This is our 10th anniversary as his work wife. <laughs> do you know, every morning John comes early into the ACES lab to feed the animals and there is actually one white large rat who stands up the moment he opens that door to greet him. I've never heard anyone so joyous to begin their day welcomed by a large white rat. That's how John views his relationship with the animals. He's interested in saving the world one child at a time. John, I would hope that you would really explore your hidden talent of organizing bridal showers to just keep rocking and uh, get back to those drums and have fun with the animals and get back to some math if that's where it goes. Happy 35th anniversary at Miami Country Day School. Happy 35th anniversary, John. Oh my God, Freddie is a riot. <laughs> she is... Passionate, devoted, honest, earnest. Driven. Uh, dedicated, passionate, loyal, purple. Undying school spirit that makes us all want to be uh, better Spartans. She um, loves the school more than anybody I know. Over 25 years, she's been a great support to me when I was a parent, when my girls were in school. She was, uh, she helped, she taught my girls. Um, when I think of alumni, they all ask about Freddie. Um, she's just a fixture in this institution, and it all she brings me uh, smiles. She's a little, you know, quirky, and that's what makes her Freddie. Purple is Freddie's favorite color, so if she had to pick an outfit, she would be wearing purple, and she marks all her students' papers with a purple marker or purple pen. When I think of Freddie, I think um, it's more than a word, but I think of her car because her car is always in the parking lot, just pulling in and knowing that I'm going to see Freddie's car there. And if it's not there, something's, something's wrong. Freddie to me just embodies everything that Miami Country Day represents. Um, in the next 35 years, I would love to see her uh, walk across that stage and give her granddaughter the uh, her uh, Miami Country Day School diploma. So I get them back over here and have them go to Country Day and have Freddie walk across and, and, and give, her, give her that diploma. One time Freddie had stopped by my classroom. I don't remember the reason. She may have been coming in for the day or leaving for the day. And she said, Whittington, you got another 35 year in you. And it meant a lot to me to be put in the same category as someone like Freddie, who's given so much to this school. Happy 35th anniversary, Freddie. Happy 35th anniversary, Freddie. Happy anniversary, Freddie. Happy 35th anniversary, Freddie. Perfectionist, and I mean it in a good way. Uh, dedicated, thorough, precise, wild and crazy. Friend. Loyal, confidant, mentor. Carolyn is tough in a good way. She's a solid person. She's a strong person, stronger than most people probably realize. They don't know her, but I'm glad that my children did. And uh, she's a, a quality individual. Back in the 1990s, when I was the upper school director, I wanted to bring Miami Country Day back into participating with the Silver Knight competition. Uh, I looked around the faculty at that time and thought who would be a great person to lead this program and immediately thought of Carolyn because of her perfectionist tendencies. I knew she would do a fabulous job. 
So we went together to our first Silver Nights and we sat there and watched the whole uh, program and at the end of it we looked at each other and we said, oh my gosh, we have to produce Mother Teresa's because there was literally a Silver Knight who had worked with the blind in India. She's just someone I feel very lucky to have in my life. Happy 35th anniversary, Carolyn. Happy 35th anniversary, Carolyn. Happy 35th anniversary at Miami Country Day School. To devote 35 years of one's life teaching is remarkable. To do it in one school is a real gift. We want to say happy anniversary to you, Freddie, John, and Carolyn, from the school and for all the thousands and thousands of students you've taught over the years. Thank you.